Hello everyone, this is Nick Martin here with the American Steam Railroad. We've made a lot of really great progress on the 2100 lately, a lot of projects seeing advancements. Let's take a closer look in our July 2022 update. Our primary focus for this month, the inspection and testing of the locomotive superheater units, is progressing at a steady pace. As of the end of July, 30 out of the 50 superheaters have been inspected and successfully tested. Of the 20 superheaters remaining, 10 have been removed from the boiler and are ready to be inspected and tested, after which the last 10 will be removed to receive the same treatment. We will be making more progress on superheater testing in the weeks to come and should have this part of the restoration finished by early September. And while we're on the topic, we'd like to give a special thank you to the Fort Wayne Railroad Historical Society for allowing us to borrow their superheater hydro testing manifold. Sharing unique specialty tools like this one helps keep costs to a minimum for us all. That's not all we've been working on though. On July 30th, a second hydrostatic test was performed on the boiler. Building on the initial hydrostatic test performed back in April, this second hydro test was performed at the FRA required 300 pounds per square inch, which is 25% above the 2100's working pressure. Our professional contractor was pleased, as only minor leaking was present, which will be easily sealed with additional lapping and new gaskets. Other projects attended to as well include cleaning out stable telltale holes, touching up the boiler protectant paint on the wrapper sheet where the new sleeves and caps were installed, and beginning the removal of the large air tank brackets. The time is coming soon for the tubes and some flues to come out of the boiler for the 1472 day inspection. And that's where you can participate in the 2100's restoration because you can sponsor the boiler's replacement tubes. Whether you choose to sponsor one foot of a tube or an entire 20 foot long tube, we're counting on your support to get the final major boiler project completed. For more information on how you can contribute, please visit the parts sponsorship section of our online gift shop. Make sure to take a look at the rest of the gift shop as well. Hats, t-shirts, books, posters, and a raffle that could win you $21,000 are all available. And anyone who's looking to get more closely involved is welcome to join American Steam Railroad as a member. ASR membership starts at only $35 per year. And as a member, you will get notices of ASR news and events, our quarterly printed newsletter, The Rambler, and the chance to work on the historic T1 herself as part of our volunteer crew. Visit our website at americansteamrailroad.org and find out how you can contribute to bringing the 2100 back to the rails today. So that's a wrap for this month's update. Once again, we'd like to thank our volunteers, contractors, donors, and our friends at the Midwest Railway Preservation Society. And once again, if you're looking to support, make sure to go to americansteamrailroad.org. We've got plenty of ways you can support our projects. Thank you for watching.